Yo, what's up guys, it's Simple Leopard here and I know what the hell, I don't have a virus, I don't have a STD, don't worry, it's just this will help me protect my eyes, that's it, huh, I don't know what I'm saying, but without wasting any time, The Walking Dead, episode 4 I think so, and we've come a lot further, so without wasting any time, let's continue, The Walking Dead, episode 4. Episode 4 around every corner, I have no idea last time what happened, but let's play. Clementine. Clementine? Oh ha, so last time we came to the house and we finally knew that the person or the person who was playing the bell was playing the bell again. It's a girl apparently. But now I think we have to look at Clementine and see if she's right or not. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? But where is she? I have season 2 also. Clem, you in here? You're, you're a fucking idiot. That's just dumb. I mean, I get it, but it's Clementine? Okay, well, that study was not worth it. Oh wait! I need a sofa. You sofa. I'll have time to rest later. Okay, well, I'm sorry. Clementine, you here? Uh, I don't think he had told us about to make a movie down. Clem? That's a bit too personal. Ain't got time for that. Let's go to the bedroom. Hello. What are you doing? Oh, you know. Know. Just poke around. You won't. I don't know yet. I didn't get there for a while. Where's Linton? Don't ask me. I'm not her keeper. Around. Like I'm in the be around. Where did he go? Last I saw she was a friend that kid who hangs around with them. I don't. Okay, that's okay. Well, let's look at the boxes. I don't think it's all over. But I just want to find Clementine. I knew that. Examine the drawers. I know Memphis Clementine. I told you that girl isn't with me. Go ask your buddies and quit bothering me. Jesus. Clementine, you up there? Shit, where could she be? Clem? Clementine? I think the bedroom but multiple bedrooms. Everything okay in there? We're fine. Just leave us alone and let the doctor work. <laughs> Clement, come out, please. Seriously, I'm shitting myself. Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. First good thing that's happened since... What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? 
Hey man, I tried, but he gave me a look like he was gonna rip my face off. He won't listen to you. You think he was gonna listen to me? Uh... <sighs> to hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! I swear, just I'm gonna go to the Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? Seriously? What the hell, dude? Nice. Open this door. Doesn't look like she's in here. Okay, well, Clementine up to the lava or whatever. Doesn't look like she's in here. Clementine, where are you? I swear you will meet me. I will show you. Not under here. Clem? Doesn't look like she's in here. Clementine! Clementine? Clementine! What the hell? I've seen almost every place. Where is the boy? I think I'm going to go. in there exploring yes. and look look what i found uh don't miss what you want to what don't tell me what car will be or probably boat yeah boat whoa i know right Jolly now. We are blessed.
Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Shit! Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well? <sighs> you want the good news or the bad news? The Let's bad get the news. bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how That's are we supposed to get that news. stuff? We should go back out on the street, see what we yep. can find. That's not gonna work. Crawford took everything and brought it inside their walls. They siphoned every gas tank, stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw for yourselves. She's right. Well, what about this Crawford place? Sounds like they'd have everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on. What the hell? Surely What's we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man? Might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? I have no idea. Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. Probably There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Uh, yeah, actually. actually. Do, but, whoa. Oh, is so the sewer system here? Sewer I think sewer? I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually oh. not the worst idea I've ever heard. Also I mean, it's best. close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought Maybe about it, it before, work. just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford ah, doesn't just smart. have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, so. it's decided, Ann. We're going to Crawford. Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? He's probably out. And I won't mind if he's out. We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. Smart. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? It's what gonna be dangerous? A lot. It's gonna be a lot of danger. Uh... No, don't okay. worry. We have a good plan and good people. We'll be in and out before they even know we're there. You trust me, don't you? Yeah. That's my girl. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Oh, shit. Where it's I'm dangerous. going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Bro, calm down. I'll be there. Can't I come with you? No, I'm sorry. No. I'm sorry.
Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Okay. Can I talk nice. to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So? <laughs> so, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming oh. everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. So, I mean, someone can leave someone to study. And now, this is another one. And now, this is her daughter. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Okay, I know. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. So first I got a flash, but now she's giving me major Assassin's Creed feeds. Hold up just a sec. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? Uh, I guess. I hope so. Plus you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omid. Well, what should I do if something happens while you're gone? Just panic. If that yeah, happens, that. if you see because or hear anyone outside you. trying to get in, I want you to find a place to hide and stay there. And don't come out till I get back. Do you understand? Find a place to hide and stay there. One other thing. If Omid gets worse while we're away, if he tries to hurt you, you know what to do, right? No, she does not. Let's get you inside. I have a gun, bro. Let's get this over with. Okay. Well, fine, I'll get that. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Oh, wow. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Let's go. Okay, well guys, I'll play for this episode. Obviously, next episode, we'll Crawford in school. We'll infiltrate and we'll take it. So if you guys are enjoying watching me play The Walking Dead and if you want me to play any other games, un games can name the description mein And uh, until the next episode or until the next game, it's simple leopard signing off. Bye bye!